They are off in the Kachina Handicap. And Easy Kitty, the favorite, is right into it, down toward the inside. Racing for gold up on the outside. Mundy is prominent at the outset. Danica also moves up. It is Easy Kitty, though, who has the lead. Danica alongside her in second now. Moving in third position is Mundy. Coconino is fourth. Two lengths behind that, Carrie Rose in fifth spot. Racing for gold is next, and Unlock the Fury is the trailer. Six furlongs remain. Quarter mile, 23 seconds. It is Easy Kitty who leads the way onto the back stretch, but she's got pressure on the outside from Danica. Danica not giving Easy Kitty an easy lead. Two and a half lengths, Coconito races next in third. Up on the outside is Mundy fourth. Another length and a half, Carrie Rose. Then three further lengths, racing for gold, unlock the Fury last as they make their way to the far turn. 45 and 4, the time for the half mile. Easy Kitty still holding sway. In front by a length and a quarter. Danica moving second. Coconino, Carrie Rose is advancing on the inside and coming quickly. Racing for gold is next. Now Mundy has dropped back and then it is unlocked the Fury last as they come to the top of the stretch and Easy Kitty has spurted away. Easy Kitty is in front by three. Carrie Rose is really the closest pursuer and the only challenger to Easy Kitty here in the stretch. Easy Kitty, though, is in front by five. Easy Kitty in the final furlong of a front-running performance. Easy Kitty, an easy winner of the Kachina Handicap. Easy Kitty by four at the end. Carrie Rose second, then racing for gold and unlock the Fury. What is it about this horse that runs so well? I don't know, do you know... The stakes she won the other day, sprinting, she come from off the pace. Today she went to the lead, so she's pretty versatile. Uh, when, uh, how, how soon into the race did you realize that uh, this horse is going to take this? Right away from the gate. When she made the lead as easy as she did, I thought she'd be tough to catch.